Why are you making top videos now? Well, it is simple. I run an offer out of content. I'm gonna be honest. Yes, working on my current job has been so demanding that sometimes I play like one or two rates and I get no customers. And also I get tired all day speaking to people repeating the same old script over and over and over and over again, being annoying to the used people on behalf of DirecTV. So American people be honest, how many times do DirecTV calls every day or every week? Write down in the comments please, I, I'm, I grew curious about this so the main topic of the video is... Of course there's people who likes to read uh, while camping like me, others play some chess or a mini game, others just watch some Netflix and other uh, streaming services. Well, from here you can order stars at 10.99 a month included outland, uh, sorry sorry the PTSD just selling stars just went up. Anyway, today I was thinking what games are entertaining to play while waiting for the customer to arrive with the loot just for you. Of course, these games are mobile games and of course, the selection of my favorites and best game to enjoy while waiting for the next victim. That keep in mind those games are selected on how much attention you need to put on, so I don't miss uh, the Russian customers also, so COD, Mo COD Mobile or PUBG Mobile are out of the line. And since they require full attention, that's why. So if you can do it, well, well, well you are a talented rat, of course. Either way, remember that this is based on only for my opinion, feel free to post yours in the comments and of course I'm gonna read it and I'm trying to, of course, reply to you, so if, if case I haven't, enjoy. So number 10, it is Duddle Jump. One of my first game around back in 2009 with mobile games starting to be a thing and this game is simple, entertaining and of course you can play without the sound in, in case you wanna hear the footsteps of the game. It is pretty simple game with one, only one premise, of course killing time and entertain yourself without paying attention too much attention to the mobile game and of course at the end of the day getting some loot while of course you are in your patrol. Number 9, it is Exo Minor. I know, I know, I know. Idle game seems to be the right choice to play while doing other things. And of course, that's, that's right. There's a ton of idle games like Adventure Capitalist, but of course, Exo Minor has to be one of the best sounds of a mobile game on collecting materials. And of course, the art is really, really good. There's one of my recommended choices to play while, willing, while waiting for customers. Uh, this game was my favorite back in 2021 extra camping videos. Uh, I was playing this game when I was camping the safe room or other, you know, if you're being since 2021, do you remember that? Number 8 Papers, please. And of course, this has to be an excellent game by its music and being a border crossing immigration officer. Kinda what we are doing in Tarkov in first play, you know? This game is great to play due to the nature of checking paperwork to the people and of course the people who want to visit at Trotska. And of course, getting harder as the time passes, with the ever-growing rules that you have to check in order to accept people or reject them. Well, in Tarkov it's a little bit simple because you deport anyone who trespasses to an extract and of course you deport them to the stash. It is very simple. In Papers, please, of course, you gotta make a choice if you wanna help a sick organization or keep the communist regime. That is your choice to make, of course. Number 7, Cut the Rope, and of course this is another masterpiece that mobile games has to offer. Cute graphics, cute design, challenging levels, the premise is simple, you gotta give the candy to the little monster on the screen and do not lose it because he gets sad. Only people who need to get upset on this one, it is people trespassing the extracts, not the little um nom. <laughs> this game is great because you can stop at any time when you hear someone coming, and of course you can resume your game without any penalties, uh, of course whatsoever. Pro tip, try to finish the whole game with 3 stars. This is very funny to solve puzzles while hearing the, tar the Tarkovs that being sound design, you know, the, the birds hearing the air and all this ambient sound design that Tarko has to offer. Mm. 
number six temple run i know i know an endless runner how predictable who would have thought that but if you play if you, if you pay close attention you will realize people are expecting subway surfers in this i'm gonna be honest i don't like it too much that game i prefer this dead not because of nostalgia you know nostalgia is a strong feeling and i was the one of the first game that i played back in 2012 on my aios oh, i don't know in the ipad you know I'm not good at um, speaking English, so it was it was great. Nothing like running from your life and avoiding all the dangers, just to die in the most unexpected way, like the guy running to the extract. Yes, yes. There's going to be an extra camping jo uh, joke on each game, so get used to it. Number five, Hasun Height. This game is a piece of art itself, unfortunately you cannot get it on the stores anymore, it was removed from iOS and Android, but you can get it from another sources, you know what I mean, because this game is where you are a sick pig, a sick green pig I think, who sneezes some buggers, and you gotta bait the monsters on the trap to pass this lever, it is pretty challenging game and with some good ad work too. So I recommend this while waiting, puzzle games are often great to pass time, so I recommend this 100%, and this game is very very rare, rare gem on the mobile games genre, and also it is good to keep the brain awake while waiting for your loot, and of course this is a strong recommendation for you to try while you are defending the extracts. Number 4, Jetpack You're Right. Of course this game has to make it out here, because this is another endless runner but this one has some charisma in it. There's some dude assaulting a love with a Gatling jetpack. Back in, the, back in the glory days of the internet, you know, 2012, 2011, this was a great idea. Now it seems like meh, but the gameplay is simple. Avoid obstacles, grab coins, rinse and repeat until madness, like me. I have over 4 years doing the same thing over and over and over again on the extracts, but I have read like 10, uh, 100 books across that time, so keep grinding some coins on this game, good, good for past some time, and of course... Um, defending the extracts in that regard. Number 3 is Robbery Bob 1 and 2. Of course, this has two games. This is a funny stealth game. You control a guy named Bob, of course, it's in the name, that you gotta well enter to the houses and steal stuff while you remain undetected. You can use the surroundings to hide and also you can disguise and you, so you don't get caught. Pretty easy premise and of course challenging levels. Perfect game for stealthing some houses while you steal some loot and of course unsuspected players running to the extracts. Unlike Tarkov, when you are guns once spotted people are going to try to gun you down in robbery bob you gotta run from the police officers they don't shoot you of course they will try to catch you and beat you just like in real life a little less drastic of tarkov i would say but this is a pretty good game overall and also one of my recommendations to be and of course while you are extra camping And number 2, Plants vs Zombies 1 and 2, yet another gem of the gaming community overall. Another game which started off good and ended off ruined by grief, but not all is lost because I would say Plants vs Zombies 1 and 2 are great to pass some time in this tower defense game where you need to use our plant tire friends in order to fight zombies, kinda like an odd premise but it is awesome at the same time. This game has one of the best soundtrack of any video game history and of course it's not the best but one of the best. The, this, uh, the second game is heavily monetized but you, it could be enjoyed too since it, it keeps a little bit of the essence of the same game and of course of the first one. So uh, this is the best choice for waiting some people. After all, Tarkov is a survival shooter rook like game but we play it as a tower defense one.
and now in number one, the best game that you can play what extra camping, one of the best experience to pass some time and enjoy a good time. It is nothing more, nothing less than Ray Shadow of Le <laughs> Wait, 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 no, I'm not that big enough to say that. Anyways, this port is reserved for Fallout Shelter, another construction and management game where you are the overseer, this guy in the charge of managing and building a vault of the Fallout universe. It is pretty and very entertaining, uh, very casual of course, and I must say, it doesn't require much of your attention and still you can have fun while, while the, gun, the gameplay it offers and of course the aesthetic of the vault boy that it has. Overall, this is a good game to play while you are overseeing the extract. Thanks for watching. I understand it ain't much, but this is honest work. Hey, I'm gonna be honest. I'm trying to be to get some clips on my very restricted schedule. Otherwise, I'm closer to my goal to have everything done and of course to come back to the clown near the extract the extracts I used to be. Regardless, thank you so much for my loyal fans and of course everyone who watches me. I always appreciate it a ton and I will be inventing new ways to get you some content and if not, well, I have tons of snow clips. <laughs> yeah, I got a lot of them and I extra cam non-stop on the snow era in the early wipe. I miss Tark of Recall of course. Anyway, Thank you so much and don't forget to check my older videos, videos sorry, and learn one or two spots either. Check it out or use it, of course that's up to you to decide. So for my part, thank you so much and better sound.